In this video, I'm gonna paint together with my brother. We're gonna collaborate again, painting inside of this rusty old tank. Well, women, come on. Yo, welcome back to another video. Today I'm gonna paint with my brother. Last time we painted was uh, last year in September. I'm gonna show you some videos right now. This time we're gonna paint at the same location where I painted the gorilla in this uh, rusty metal barrel. Yeah, so let's start. I decided to paint on the opposite side of my gorilla mural. The size of the wall fits perfectly. While my brother started his first lines, I decided to get one more tire just in case because I didn't bring my ladder this time so I can climb on the tires to have a better reach. But I realized that I will come the next day anyway, so I will bring the ladder with me. This time I didn't bring much of the materials, it all fitted in my backpack. I never brought less for painting, because I knew that I will paint a smaller piece. Like last time I had to clean the wall from the chipped off paint and my brother already started with the background, he's really fast. Ok, it's time for me to start with the first lines. I brought only two premixed wall paints that I prepared the day before, one mid-tone for the rhino and one for the background, because I knew that I will use more spray cans this time. I had to wear my respirator mask for the whole time, because my brother used some very toxic paint for his background and it was not possible to breathe in there, and I already had a headache so this smell didn't help at all. Now I mixed a darker color of this turquoise. I used a black pigment that I brought with me. I had the feeling that the painting needed one more darker shade of this tone. I only had two spray paint variations of this color, adding these two wall paint variations on top, then you have four shades of this turquoise color so later it will look much better. This time I wanted to paint these background designs more cleaner and sharper. So here you can see me trying to tape it and spray over, just to see how it looks. Ok, so this is the second wall paint that I brought with me. This brown color should mimic the rusty wall behind. The painting looks so much better on a darker than on a lighter background. It is slowly getting dark. My brother is almost finished with his piece. Now it's time to paint the background elements. I started with the orange side first. The 
Spray paint didn't cover this rusty metal wall very well. I had to paint over a couple of times. I love how this purple looks good next to the orange and then you have the turquoise in the middle. You will see it much better on the end when it's finished. Now it's time to paint the details finally. I always start with the eyes first and then I work my way around. With the black spray paint I define more of the details, the shape and the wrinkles. I also gave the rhino some of these designs. Yo, it's day two, it's a couple days later, in the meantime the snow melted, as you can see it. Yeah, so let's continue. Okay, the next thing what I'm gonna do now is that I want to paint the background elements. Uh, but I want to tape them, so I have a clean and sharp lines. i never done this before. Uh, I decided for this painting I want to do this. Uh, instead of painting rough uh, background elements, I'm gonna tape them, so I have a clean and sharp line. Best part, remove the tape. Now you have a nice and clean, sharp lines. Okay, now let's do the other parts. Okay, the last thing what I want to do is I want to paint the white outline above the rhino, around the ears and around the head and this white spray paint is very terrible at that because it makes a lot of drips so wish me luck Yo, the mural is finished, but before I show it to you, I have a little announcement. I paint these murals for free, so they are not paid. It's all paid by me, and they cost a lot of money. If you want to maybe support me, you can do it by Patreon or buy me a coffee. 
This will help me a lot. It will give me more of financial freedom so I can paint more murals and make more videos for you guys. So if you want to support me, the links are in the description below. Thank you very much and this is the final result. Which one do you like more, the gorilla or the rhino? Please let me know in the comments down below. Thanks for watching, see you next time. If you wanna maybe support me, you can do it by Patreon now. Okay, the chainsaw massacre.